Okay, so we have another repair today, 11 Pro, that came for error 4013. Initially, it was stuck on the recovery mode. <coughs> so what I did, I connected uh, with the computer and I have this software with 3U tools. So in the 3U tools, when I connected the device, is not gonna connect now because it's uh, looping. The, initially, it came with the iTunes logo and everything. So I came on this uh, <coughs> 3U tools and um, it was connected here. It was saying flash or exit recovery mode. So I said exit recovery mode. So it came out of exit recovery mode. Um, it's out of the recovery mode now. Uh, but what it's doing, it's in the loop, Apple logo loop. Uh, and that usually happens uh, with my experience so far we have so many of X and X's and 11's and all that that usually happens because of this flex so this is the flex um, and I'm sure that when I'm gonna disconnect it it should be okay 100% guaranteed so I'm gonna just uh, disconnect the charger yeah and I'm gonna disconnect the battery disconnected and I'm gonna disconnect this flex as well so that flex is disconnected now so so flex is disconnected uh, battery is disconnected I'm gonna connect the battery back in okay and then what we're gonna do we're gonna test if that makes any difference that should do I think what the customer did, they change the probably LCD. No, it looks original. Probably, I think they did something here because uh, the some of the plates it's supposed to have two plates. So I only got one plate, so the other plate is missing. So what I've done, I've disconnected the battery, um, that flex, uh, which is the earpiece uh, and the mic and the uh, face ID. Flex and now we're gonna connect the charger and see what happened. And remember, it was <coughs> in a boot loop when we initially checked it, and then uh, when I started making a video of it, and then it was keep on looping. Apple logo. Now we have disconnected the flex. We're gonna see what it does. Um, the shore is coming on because in that amount of time it would have rebooted already. So I'm gonna put this thing on customers so see that uh, it's on it's on it's no more in loop so what we're gonna do we um we are gonna work on this flex and then we're gonna see that if it's fixable what is the problem with that so stay with us device is on so guys, we what we done? Uh, we removed the flex, and then we found a surprise that uh, this part is broke in two pieces. Actually, is one part is here, and the other part is stuck here. So it's supposed to be one complete part, and uh, we also have some traces of liquid uh, here. So that could be a reason that is uh, looping so I'm gonna remove this and then I'm gonna see that if it works okay so this device um, it is uh, powering on with the flex on so what we have done we have removed that bit that is um, dot projector I'm sure it is that's the part um, that is essential for the face ID and I have cleaned it um, and uh, I've removed the whatever liquids were underneath it and I'm gonna put it back on and then we're gonna see if it works because right now it's coming up with the face ID error the device is on but it's coming up with the face ID error We'll see that if you can fix it. So now this phone is not showing 
face ID error what we have done we have connected the flex it is connected and we also have put that part in so what we're gonna do we're gonna check if the face ID is working uh, the error is gone good thing and it's not looping as well before it was looping when I was connecting that flex well we don't have error problem is that we do not have a code so we don't have a code so we can't check it so we can let the customer know that we have managed to take it out from the recovery mode and uh, it's data is still there so now we're gonna see that if uh, the face ID works 11 Pro Max 11 Pro Max yeah. been fixed um, if you have any device like this do contact us and we can sort you out okay 11 Pro Max um, everything is done uh, we don't have a code I mean everything is done initial problem has been fixed a face ID error has been fixed and uh, it's not coming over the error loop has been fixed and uh, now i'm gonna just close it and uh, before we close very very important thing always disconnect the battery because if the battery is connected and you're putting the screws on and then it can cause some sort of shortage so you gotta make sure that you, you do disconnect the battery so here you go yes. That. So that's the Okay. All the screws on, and then I'm gonna do a final test on it. Um, we also have another iPhone. Is that seven get came for shortage? iPhone seven. Yeah. Uh, is it eight or seven? How do you know? Is eight or seven? It doesn't have the home button, is it? Oh, yeah, the home button. So this is the one. We're gonna check. It came for no power. So we're gonna check after this. Uh, these devices are very, very delicate. And then you gotta be very careful with these devices. So whenever you're working on them, make sure the battery is disconnected. As we have done here. The battery is not disconnected. You might have pain in the backside. <laughs> okay, so this uh, plate is missing. There's supposed to be another plate here, which is not here. Customer opened the device and then came to us for error four zero one three, where it didn't have a problem. It had a problem with the face ID flex. So I'm letting it reboot and uh, just hiding the customer face and um, sometimes you get a, a, a customers a pictures on the screen so that is the reason we do that um, so before we were getting two errors here system uh, no sim card and then the face id the face id has been gone it's been fixed so if you have any devices like this do contact with us and uh, yep yeah. cheers thank you very much and do subscribe our channel and do like the videos thank you and do leave some sort of comments so we can um talk to you guys thank you very much Ta -da, bye bye